Welcome back everybody. Welcome back to KIR, which is keeping it real. On today's video, what you're gonna hear about is an unboxing of the Nintendo Switch Lite. I'm gonna show you the Nintendo Switch Lite. I'm gonna unbox it for the 2020, show you what I have, show you my carrying case, what memory card I got, and the basic screen protector that I'm gonna be using. Gonna be doing more videos on the Nintendo Switch, so I want you to check me out. On this channel, you're gonna hear about tech, gaming, and more. And what makes us different is we're gonna keep it real, what's good, bad, ugly, or indifferent on this channel. So check us out, we like to upload once a week. But again, let's get right into it. The Nintendo Switch Lite. Let's head to the table. All right, welcome back. We're at the table. As you can see, we're gonna unbox the Nintendo Switch Lite and the accessories that I have for it. What I have is a memory card, scan disc, 64 gig, Super Mario Brothers carrying case with a screen protector. What I also have is, what I also have is a grip for the Nintendo Switch Lite. And of course, the main part of it, the Nintendo Switch Lite. So first thing we're gonna box is the Nintendo Switch Lite. Let's see if I can get this open. I got it in yellow. Um, it had gray, just thought yellow would be a little bright. Might as well check it out. Nothing else in the box. This is a lot less stuff than the original. The original had a bunch of different moving parts. This is just one simple, this is one simple hole piece. There's the console. Let's see what else we have in here. We have your usual manual books and stuff. Not gonna read it, so rip, rip, slide it to the side. And then we have your power adapter. All right, let's unbox the next stuff that we have. All right, next thing we have was a grip because the Nintendo Switch Lite is a little small in my hands. Now the big one had to add a grip, so the small one obviously um, had a grip. I got the grip in yellow because the Nintendo Switch is in yellow. Get it open. All right, for protection, got a hard back right here and rubber with a little grip on the sides. Us in the box, nothing. Rip, rip, slide that to the side. Put this one out the packaging. Got a little stuff on the back of this. Let's get that on out of there. All right. Nice little hard back. Nice and rubbery. Feel good in the hands. You understand what that means? I'm digging it. I like it. Got the little cutouts, everything. Volume, power. Speaker cutouts. All right. Charging ports. Okay. Move on to the next thing. All right, I got this case from uh, GameStop. Had Super Mario Brothers on it. I love red. When I do my MacBook review on here, you'll see I like red. So when you see a lot of red stuff, red leather Mac. You can get it. All right, let's get in here. All right. Bust open the box a little bit. Nothing else in here. Slide to the side, rip, rip. I like your basic case for the light. We'll unzip it. Let's see what we got. All right. Pocket here at the top. Power adapter in there. We got a slot for games, so they can get what? I don't know, five, six, maybe seven games in there. Got a cleaning cloth, screen protector, which we'll put on because it's a touchscreen device. Pretty nice. Let's move on to the next thing. No Nintendo Switch, regular or light, is done unless you get a memory card. This one I got 64 gig. So, I, I like scan this, so that's why I remember scan this. And let's go on and get this out and slide it in. All right, this is everything out the boxes. I already put the screen protector on because you've seen the screen protector millions of times. So I ain't just want to put it on so you can reset it again. The main reason why I personally got the Nintendo Switch Lite is because for the holidays, a lot of people are going out there to switch and the switch light and people were wondering which one should you get 
I do another video later about which one should you get in 2020. But far as some people are concerned, money is an issue because we're in a pandemic. So the Nintendo Switch Lite is a cheaper version. It is a little different than a regular Switch. I explained differences in another video. But pretty much I got this one for $179. It came with the Nintendo Switch Lite and the power adapter. That's all you get that is different from the regular Nintendo Switch. I'll put a link up to the other video when I, when I unlocked or when I unbox the regular Nintendo Switch. You get a lot more pieces to it. So as I said before, the Nintendo Switch Lite console, the power adapter, the case slash grip, the memory card. All right, let's put the memory card in so you get a chance to check that out where that goes. This is just a tad bit different than the regular Nintendo Switch. It's yellow, so it might reflect a little bit, but my lights I got going on. So we just gotta pop this off right here. See the hole right there. We're just gonna put the memory card in. So let's see if we can do this. Slide that right in. Nope, wrong way. So we're gonna slide this one right in. Push it down. We're just gonna file this down. It's in the top for the game slot. You got the power, volume's up and down. You got your power, volume up and down, game card slot for your headphone jack. Okay, now what we're gonna do is put it inside this, like I told you, a protective case in the back and also for grips. Just gonna take it, just gonna prop it, slide it right in. Just gonna take it, prop it, gonna slide it right in. Look like it goes with it, look like it was made for it. Yellow on yellow, yellow almost kind of matches the regular yellow of the switch. And I think it works out well. So I pick it up, yeah, it matches it quite well for me. The yellow on yellow looks good. Everything is great and good to go. Power this bad boy on. go Nintendo switch like I said for the 2020 during the pandemic if money is tight this would be the better way to go because this one again starts off at 199 all right this all it was was an unboxing to let you know the thoughts on the Nintendo switch Lite, the things that I bought the different accessories I do another video comparing this one to the regular switch for 2020 and also my thought process for the new holidays coming up for 2020 which one should you buy but again if money is tight i think this is the better way to go because of the pandemic going on right now all right i'll catch you on the next one have a good time see you again hey folks don't forget to like subscribe turn on notifications don't forget to hit that bell so you know the next time that we have a video on krr Appreciate it.